I am here for those women. I think having the support of me telling my... Hey guys, welcome back to Filmvert. They may sound like something an individual would die to have. People think that this being well-known and famous has its perks, which somewhat is true. But they need to know that it doesn't stay that way forever. So, many stars have lost everything and are broke now. So, let's see who they are. Number 5, Wesley Snipes. Wesley Snipes is an American actor, as well as a director, who has worked in a lot of movies, like Passenger 57 and Blade, which is one of the best movies and was loved by the audience. His performance has been exceptionally well, but things went a little south for him when he was caught going against the taxation policies. He was too busy enjoying his success and fame to realize that he hasn't been paying taxes. Back in 2006, he was charged for many tax-related offenses. He was majorly equated for felony federal tax fraud, which took a toll on his life as well as his career. When two years later, he couldn't return the previous taxes, he was imprisoned for three years, which ruined things for him and made him lose everything. But these, are, these are the bumps and bruises of life. You know, they build character. Number four, Kim Basinger. Kim Basinger is an American actress, singer, and even a former fashion model. She was known for her beautiful looks and also because she was married to Alec Baldwin. But the luck wasn't on her side when one of the most financial decisions left her bankrupt in the late 80s. Her family advised her to buy the town of Braselton. She dropped about $20 million to make a deal and finally became the owner of the town, which she later wanted to change to a forest hub and establish a film festival. But later, when she refused to work in a film, she was sued by the production company and was charged for eight million dollars. To do that, she had to sell her town and file for bankruptcy. That made her lose things that she worked so hard for. One, this one doesn't. <laughs> this one gets on the cats. Number three, Gary Coleman. Gary Coleman was an American actor and comedian who was well known for his work in different strokes, which instantly gave his career an uplift. He wasn't only known for his work, as well as his financial issues, and him being broke. Unlike the other stars who lost their earnings to their lame financial decisions, Gary lost it to his parents and financial advisors, who he sued because they were mishandling his funds. Along with this, chronic kidney disease, two sucked all of his money from his bank accounts and left him broke. He filed for bankruptcy and started running some trust funds, the rich he used to pay his medical bills. His medical condition led him to the point to where he had no money and his fame didn't help with that and only made things worse for him. Fantasize about, because now we, you know, here we are in 1993, I'm 25 years old. Number two, Janice Dickinson. Janice is an American model who is pretty famous for her looks and for her modeling career. She wasn't only a model, but later because of her personality, many reality shows offered her agency and wanted to be on her show. It was reported later that she owes over $1 million to people, and she is in debt. Some part of it is owed to her cosmetic surgeon, who helped her get the look she wanted. She was made fun of everywhere on the TV channels, whether it was gossip shows or even news channels, saying that her face could tell where all the money went. She wants to stay young, to look not her age, and her financial conditions didn't support each other at all, and that led to her being broke and left with less or no money. In my room, he had given me wine, and- Hey, hold up. Before we move on, do us a favor and click that big red subscription button. And oh, don't forget to hit that bell icon so you don't miss out on any of our videos. All right, back to the video. Number one, Nicolas Cage. You must be wondering why an Oscar-winning actor would be in this kind of condition. 
taking up roles that didn't suit him and weren't worthy of his attention or talent considering he was one of the highest paid actors in Hollywood. The answer to all this is something that he said in one of his interviews, that he was working because he needed money buying castles, islands, and real estates, had left him in debt of about $14 million, because of which he was believed and blamed and later sued his business manager too. He was so in need that he auctioned off some of his houses and even his first action comic. Back. Thank you, thanks for having me back. You are getting all kinds of rave reviews for, for this. Sometimes popularity gets to your head and things get out of hand. These are a few examples of people who went in flow and spent all their money on useless things, which led to them losing everything. Well, this brings us to the end of our video. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and if you did, then let us know by liking this video, sticking around for more amazing content as well. We will be seeing you soon in another video. Until then, take care and goodbye!